Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I'll be reacting really to episode 3 of season 2 of Overlords. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Mm -hmm. Huh. Do you guys have to do this? Oh shit, Cody! Stop! <laughs> Damn it, dog! You do this on purpose! You can't do that! Stop! It's <laughs> me! Oh! That's a scratch. He, um, he just like the blood? What is it? You might get eggs! No! You know, if only the voice actors of Aqua and Kazumi from Persona 5, because you know, he was her persona, and then we would be funny. <laughs> persona 5 R, my bad. But still, if she could use that persona, <laughs> we'd be done in a heartbeat. <laughs> oh god I would have watched this yesterday but you know like typically I'm tired and after I've watched maybe several animes in a day I'm like oh yeah shit I gotta do extra shit I'm like not today so I have this plus my two Patreon shows to finish today for the following week then I I still got Attack on Titan later on tonight at like 8.45 at night. Uh, and then, how do you guys Let me check something real quick. See, this is the episode of freaking um, reincarnated as a slime. The filler that we didn't get, you know, when Cosmo Lizardman was like, "Yeah, let me go kick some butt," even though we kind of saw him kick some butt, but not going in depth into Mm. 
Now I hear it. At first, I'm like, no, that's not awkward. Mm, right there. There's our useless goddess. <laughs> An adorable consumer. Yeah, can y'all just fucking talk, please? Again, yeah. hell, I don't think so. I don't even know. I ain't gonna know until like five, which is next week. It is a snake in the liquor. Uh, mm -hmm. Got a little too close for comfort. I need a fan. Well, you're probably not going to get that answer until, like, what, episode five?
hello, eyes. <laughs> Even if it's only for a moment. <laughs> And there it goes. Great. <laughs> mm -hmm. And most of you will die, and that is okay. But the ones who survive, you know. You'll do awesome. Question, do they have to make the Lizardmen like CGI as well? Uh, okay, that's fine now. What? <laughs> <laughs> Go shut up in this bitch! <laughs> mm. This is how, like, the, the battle in Game of Thrones <laughs> Hmm. Well, technically their commanders are hiding. Damn, you even got world. Uh, see, I'm not surprised about that, but are you, you even got Pumba too? <laughs> uh, I wouldn't be surprised if, like, you know, a lion. Damn, Rafiki would have been up in here. <laughs> And eating your cockroach. So is Jimmy is just gonna go all the way over there? And then whatever it is, I ain't gonna know until like what five, six.
fuck? See, mm mm. Retreat. Even though I'm doing timeout. <laughs> Retreat. <laughs> How the fuck are you gonna buy them time? Damn, one by one, they're all dying. Yeah, I, I don't even think that's going to work. Why do I feel like it's a distraction for? And he's going to hop up. Maybe. Mm hmm. Of course. <laughs> Now see what the fuck Aqua gonna do. Is this something that, uh-uh, no. Okay, good. Because I thought it was going to be like, mm, here's your deepest, biggest fear. That's, you know, like, uh, thank God. Mm. Mm. You know, this would be a really good time to show some OP, but... No, because he's going to use that to his advantage. He's going to hide in the shadows, and he's going to be right behind you.
looks pretty blood. I don't know how to feel about this episode. It was still good, though. I mean, I wouldn't really consider, like, the ending a cliffhanger. And I think a lot of people said that either this episode or 4 and 5 are going to be in the cliffhanger. And I think it was more of episode 4 coming up soon. So I'm just like, okay, that's fine. I mean, you know, because the funny thing was, originally, I was going to watch 4 and 5. I mean, not 4 and 5. 3 and 4 together until I did ask some people. And then I saw a comment and everyone was saying, no, 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 just watch 3. And now I kind of understand why. But, I mean, I feel like now I know why they're doing this Lizard Man arc. Just to give other characters, like, that shine of a moment. To have them, like, be more, not um, minor characters, but major characters. Because, typically, most of these characters didn't really have um, a little, maybe, like, a bit to none of a speaking role in Season 1, from what I remember. Because... It's just like that, because not everyone in season one or season two or even season fucking 20 of a show, if there ever is a season 20 of a show, um, is always going to have, like, a speaking role. Like, think of the character from Naruto. Like, literally, did everyone in that show have a speaking role? I don't think so, because, you know, they all started out, yes, here's everyone talking, and then by the time we got to the end of the series, characters who were important were just background characters. But, I mean, it was an interesting freaking episode to have like characters who are they're important to the plot and important to Ainz but then to just have an episode specifically on them and then plus these lizard men but I don't think we're done with the lizard men just yet I think we have like either these next two episodes about them or maybe just one more episode about them I mean thank god Ainz was finally in this damn episode because it, it still is weird to like not have the focus on him but he is still in the plot of this quote-unquote arc however long it is which could be until possibly episode five because I'm guessing that's when it's gonna end and we're gonna get something different I mean the question I'm still wondering is like is Pandora's actor still going to be somewhat in this because he was barely in like the last few episodes of season one coming into this season I really have no like freaking clue and then everything else in the nutshell of questions I had in season one going into this season and then whatever the fuck is gonna happen because honestly right now I really have no clue of what the freak is gonna happen in this show and I mean uh, you know, it scares me, but I like that, though. I, I like not knowing whatever's gonna happen next, because if I do know, then I'm always sitting in the background thinking in the back of my head, like, I can't talk about that guy, aka My Hero Academia and fucking Fruits Basket, because of reasons, and then probably anything else that I've read the manga for, because, ugh. But I, I mean, like, I think with this series, I want to read the light novel, but then it's like, do I really have time? Because I'm already reading... Fruits Basket and Hero and then a little bit of some other stuff and I don't even know if I have time to add an extra thing to all the other shit that I'm doing but I don't know I mean I never truly know and then someone's like yeah go ahead and fucking read it just like how a lot of people did with um Seven Deadly Sins and everybody wanted me to read the second after we finished season two and I was like no because I don't want to know shit and then look Season 3 is supposedly coming in this fall, which we don't know anything about, unless people who have officially read that manga, but other than that, guys, that is my reaction to Beatrice episode 3 of Season 2 of Overlord. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Metro Squad, and of course, I will see you guys officially all next Tuesday for episodes 4 and 5. Bye, guys.